Welcome to the near the southwestern tip of Iceland, the Reykjanes Peninsula. And we're here at one of the more impressive hot springs. This is the Gunavar Hot Spring, um, <clears throat> which apparently is continuously erupting. I don't know if that makes it qualify more as a geyser, but it's it's throwing not just not just steam coming out of that vent, there's water being thrown out as well. Um, out here in the distance behind this steam plume we can see this um, geothermal power plant and Iceland is known for its geothermal energy. Um, there's geothermal greenhouses that allow them to grow some of their own produce at times. And I believe that geothermal power plant uh, have two wells and or excuse me 12 wells that go down about 8600 feet or so and tap water that's about 600 degrees Fahrenheit. And so that hot water comes up and then they have a binary system that they use to turn uh, two turbines to generate uh, the electricity. I think it's around 100 megawatts or so. Uh, at least that was what I read in looking at that a little bit. But we can see a lot of the, the alteration of the material here. So just like you might see in Yellowstone, as the water is this hot water is mixing with volcanic gases like hydrogen sulfide and sulfur dioxide uh, creates acidic conditions which allow the water to um, chemically dissolve some of the rock and also precipitate other materials so we can see some of the the yellow down here which is probably sulfur rich some of the red which is hematite and iron oxide uh, and there's other minerals in there as well but it's essentially turning the rock into kind of clay type minerals. Um, we can see some of the steam over here on this, this hill, uh, these fumaroles. There's a few little mud pots there, but the main vent appears to be uh, this one here, Gunavar. Um, there's also a large crater behind it that I'm, I'd be interested in taking a look at if we could get over there. Uh, probably wouldn't appreciate me going off the boardwalk though. Uh, similar to what you see in in Yellowstone. We can see there's a big cone up here. So these are some of the more recent eruptions over the last several hundred or, or thousand or so years. Um, and then Lighthouse here is near the, the southwestern tip. And then there's a row of craters on the horizon uh, forming uh, a fissure. There was a fissure eruption there, I believe uh, eight to 900 years ago. Let me see if I've got that anywhere. Um, yeah, about 800 years ago or so. So we'll head down to the coast and look at some other things, but just wanted to give you a quick look at the Gunavar Hot Spring slash geyser. Um, just a continuously erupting hot water. I did zap it with the, the thermometer. Uh, I'm quite a ways away from it, but it's at least uh, 150 or so degrees. I'd, I'd be surprised if it's not quite a bit higher than that. So here we are, Iceland. <laughs> 